This is the detached garage indoor air handler. And uh, again, this is beyond uh, the scope of this inspection, but when I'm here, hey, so, and you know, some houses I inspect have two systems, so why not you know, say something about it? So, this is a heat pump system. It's 14 years old. Alright? They last about 14. They last about 14. So, now, heat pumps and electric heating elements, there's a heat strip in there, uh, they you know, have a tendency to last a little longer. This unit in the garage, of course, it's a nice garage. Alright, so I imagine they spent some time in here, but it doesn't get the same, you know, service use as the, the, the house. It's constantly air conditioned. So, I mean, it's appearance belies its age. There's that. We don't have a care and use manual. Um, the air filters are, what are they? It's uh, 27 by 27 by 4. The, this is an updraft system. So what happens here is that when you have an updraft system, you're supposed to have a safety pan, a galvanized safety pan in the plenum underneath the unit. And I, I get it, it goes on the garage floor, it goes out, that's your safety pin. It's not protecting a house or anything, right? So, that's what we have. The primary evaporator drain line, actually the only evaporator drain line, uh, has a shadow trap. And uh, since this probably goes outside, this is the trap required. But let's say that it goes into the plumbing, then you should have a deeper trap and the primary, regardless of whether you have the trap or not, or where it drains, uh, this should be insulated. It should be insulated. So the I'm not seeing nasty sealer around the plenum connections. Of course, it's the same area. It's just going out to the garage. It's one room. It's all your air conditioning. But it would be reasonable to assume that you know, your plenum connections leak. And again, where we're at. So, what have we learned? We learned we don't have a carrying use manual. We learned that the unit is 14 years old. We learned that um, it's a heat pump system. We learned that we only have one drain line of primary. We do not have a secondary. And it has a shallow trap and it's not insulated. We learned that we do not have a galvanized uh, or plastic, I believe. Anything that's, you know, the manufacturer rates it, it needs code, but we do not have a liner. Underneath the plenum, and then uh, we've got pretty big size air filters right there. And it came online, and it's so far, it's too cold outside. So far, it's too cold to run the air conditioner to get you know, to, you know, temperature split. That right there, so somebody was carrying. All right, so GFCI protected in the garage. And these are GFCI protected, but they're not labeled. And these fluorescent lamps in the garage, they should have protective covers, prism covers on them. 